Yo, what's going on guys, it's Soul Tracker, and welcome to an updated video on this server called Destiny PvP. And so basically Destiny PvP is this really good faction server. So IP will be down in the description as well as all these links that will hook up to your store. There's currently an 80% off sale on the web store, so you guys can go purchase that. But this is mainly just going to be an informational video and uh, some giveaway information as well. So stick to the end to watch that. So basically I'm going to go through the server and just show you guys what has been added to the map 2 of after the reset. So we got custom enchants. That is pretty much the biggest thing that has been added. So we got the enchanter right here. And you can go ahead and click this enchantment information. This gives you all the information that you can get on weapons and everything. So just go through this and you guys can find out uh, what you can get over there. And then over here is the tinker. So you can go ahead and trade with the tinker and you can just like fix stuff basically and you have your good old ender chest so down over here we have the f top prizes so there is either 250 paypal for number one or 500 on bycraft which is super awesome and then you got 200 on bycraft and then 100 on bycraft for the third reward so it's very competitive you guys are very very good cannoners you could probably win this season but over here we have the gym buckets so if you guys don't know what gym buckets are basically it's a very, very simplified version of ginning walls. Way faster. So make sure you guys uh, craft these gem buckets. And there is actually a kit base, I believe. And that just gives you obsidian, cobble, and all these lava and water buckets. So that makes it even easier for you guys to do that. Over here, we got sand scaffolding. Basically, you craft this and then you place that block on the ground. And then we'll uh, build sand up. So make sure you place it on the ground and then it will build a sand wall up but we have added the slash shop which is an amazing upgrade from last season because we had a normal shop and this is the shop july it looks way better and a lot more precise and compact as well we have added a uh, crop hopper so basically you do slash chest and chest crop so this is the crop hopper so basically as you see anything that drops in the chunk it will automatically place to this chest which is really really helpful and then you also have chest mob and that brings up uh, this really basically almost the exact same thing as a crop except for mobs so it's super super helpful I really like that addition there will be some more features will be adding pretty soon so the border is 10k by 10k and then envoys happen every so often and then we also have uh, spawner upgrades this season as well so over here is the cough event so you can do cough and then schedule i believe schedule and that just shows you the schedule and then over here is the outpost if you guys don't know what outpost is basically it works the same way as the cough except once you capture the region you are able to sell your items uh those items up there for basically two times once you capture the outpost you can go to this warp outpost sell and that will take you up there and that is where you can sell pretty much double the prices of the normal shop which is pretty awesome so this is the brand new spawn and out here is a war zone but it's like a castle wall basically which is pretty cool i like that idea and then over here you have the pathways i really like this pathway up here but basically after you go outside the spawn it's war zone and then there's a little castle walls and then out here is where you can basically pvp this is the main war zone and uh, this is pretty cool i i really like this so there will be some more staff series coming soon so you guys can be looking forward to that and i want to mention about the faction so there is a one minute gap will cool down currently and then it is mainly a pot pvp server so we have five allies per faction 50 members and then in a certain faction and then each member in that faction has a hundred power basically so if you do f power as you see i have 89 of 100 so the max power that you can get per player is 100 which is really really nice we also have five alts online per ip so make sure you guys keep that in mind as well and uh, that's pretty much all that's pretty much everything with the new features uh make sure you guys come on ip is down below now for the giveaway information so currently in my ender chest i do have uh five special keys so comment your ig and subscribe and make sure you're on the server if you haven't joined the server and are not actively playing even you win if you win and you're not actively online 
you won't get these keys. So make sure you're actively online, subscribe and comment your IGN. So I'm going to be giving away five of these uh, specifically to five different people. That is what I'm going to be giving away for the normal prizes. So the grand prize winner uh, is going to be different from the rest of the people that are going to win the five crate keys. Basically, uh, it's going to be $10 on buy craft. So it's going to be a total of $10. So you can have like several types of crate key bundles that adds up to $10. You can have, um, oh, someone just donated. GG, thanks for supporting the server. So basically, as I was saying, either you can have $10 uh, all together or you can add it up to $10. So that could be like several crate keys. That could be a rank upgrade or maybe two rank upgrades depending on the sell, but it has to add up to $10 and no more. So just keep that in mind when you're, uh, if you're the grand prize winner. And if you do uh, win the grand prize winner, you can just message me in game or something and just tell me what you want. Or you can put it in the comments or on the forums. I'll make a uh, thread about this as well. So just keep that in mind. It's something that adds up to $10. So come on the server, start playing and um, have fun and raid and all that good stuff. So I will see you guys next time. Peace.